Hello, welcome back to Brain Tease TV. Today we're going to be looking at the all electric Hyundai Ionic. We're going to be looking at that um, adaptive cruise control feature, which I find really interesting. I quite like that feature actually. It's one of my favorite features. We're going to be focusing more though on, on how long it takes to stop functioning after you've taken the hand off the steering wheel. Because if you know anything about the Ionic uh, or even the Kona, with the adaptive cruise control, you have to keep your hand on the steering wheel. If you take it off um, for a certain amount of time, then the, you'll get a lot of beeps and chimes telling you to put your hands back on, but there's some warning. And eventually the system will just give up on you and just say, listen, you're not listening, so I'm going to stop working, stop functioning. So you'll need to put your hand back on the steering wheel. But we want to look at how long it actually takes um, I know it's in seconds, but we're going to do a, a measure, real-world test, um, and see how long it takes. I'll try and stick a little clock just up there for you to see um, how long it's actually taking um, to, to stop a different function. I think the first um, the first time you take your hand off, you get a warning. Then you get a second warning, the, thing, the screen turns red, and then the final warning gives you a few more seconds, then it will just take off that um, automatic steering function I think it still keeps on the lane ke lane keep assist but the automatic steering comes off and you have to take control of the of the vehicle um, so let's have a look and see how long it takes right so let's get into it right right hands off the steering right let's keep this steady and it's going we're out doing 71 miles an hour this is the auto high beam keeps coming on and off there right there we go so it's giving me that first warning telling me to keep hands on steering wheel right bring it a bit closer so we can see right so it's saying now it's gone a bit red so it's getting critical See how long it takes before it disconnects the steering. Right, still going, still steering, still going, still going, still going. Right, there we go, stop blinking. Right, that's it. So, there you have it, people, hands back on the steering. So, there you have it. Um, that will give you a good indication of how long it will take before the steering disconnects and you have to take control again right hope you found this useful thank you don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and we'll catch you in another one but as always be safe